just driving out of Minehead at the present time. And on the way in this morning, the new cycle path between Minehead and uh, Dunster looked pretty well complete. I know it's not com fully complete, but it looks a lot smarter now with all the uh, road up signs and barriers removed. Let's have a look. On the way in, I also noticed that they've erected that controversial indication sign of where to turn to get to Dunster. Look at those cars. They were quick, weren't they? I didn't have time to actually zoom in on them. Anyway, this is where the most changes were noticed this morning. All that burning work is gone. And it's all looking very really clean and tidy and quite inviting if you're a cyclist, I should think. Over there. No more traffic lights, that's great at long last. A few more bits and pieces being done on the side. Yeah, for ages people could see a big tall posts going up and when they wonder what it was all about. That's what it's all about. Oh, that's okay. Doesn't look too bad, does it? Okay. People were scared that it might be too large, but that seems reasonable. Oh, and cyclists look trying it out. That's good. It's not quite clear in there yet. Oh, it's it on that board. Did it? What yeah. did it say? Dunster Beach and went very clear now. Right. We're we walking along here too. All oh, right. Yeah, after all the controversy, this exhibit's been worthwhile. I think cyclists come to a sudden narrow ending about here, but this thing cycles through. Right. Yeah, and that looks pretty well complete to me. No more congestion here, which is a great relief. Really Just thinking if the train was running slightly late, we might just see it at what's at station. How oh, we might have missed it. Don't see any steam. I think we must have missed it. Can you put it in there for a second? Oh. Oh. Missed it. Go one stop. Tennis, you see. Priority number one. <laughs>